Greetings, traveler. How about a song? The... that there on your hip. No, I'm sorry. It's nothing. I don't mean to pry. No worries. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Cass. I'm a bard traveling this land in search of ancient songs. Have you heard of the ancient songs of Hyrule? No. Mm. Ancient songs. Songs that sing the praises of a hero who beat back the calamity in an age past. One of the most famous songs among them recounts the events of 10,000 years ago. I happen to know a song about the ancient hero who was passed down to me by my teacher. Do you care to hear it? Let's do it. Excellent. Without further ado. The kingdom of Hyrule is a vast and storied land, oft grasped in the palm of a villainous hand. A dark force of destruction, many times undone, rises once again, Ganon, the Calamitous One. But hope survives in Hyrule, for all is not lost. Two brave souls protect it, no matter the cost. A goddess blood, blood princess and fearless knight, they appear in each age to fight the good fight. Their battle with Ganon I've committed to song, to keep it through time, no matter how long. Now begins the second verse, listen and you'll know, of their battle with Ganon 10,000 years ago. The kingdom of Hyrule was once a land of lasting peace, a culture of strength and wit, that suffering did cease. But Ganon lurked beneath the surface, strengthening its jaw, so ancient people of Hyrule set out to help the cause. Lots of towers, chat. Their efforts bore fruit in an automated force to help avert calamity by sealing it at its source. For giant behemoths for which power never ceased, each of these titans was called a divine beast. The free world machines that hunted down their prey, these guardians will built to last so they could join the fray. Yeah, making it flow with rhymes. To guide the beasts in battle, warriors were needed, so four champions pledged to see the great Ganon defeated. Divine beasts, guardians, princess, and knight, their plan to rout Ganon was looking airtight. When Calamity Gaddon reared its head, Hyrule rose against it. The optimism of Hyrule all the more incensed it. Ganon raged in its assault, boiling with hate. It gnashed its teeth and thrashed about, but it was all too late. The Guardians kept the heroes safe through every hour. The Divine Beast unleashed attacks that weakened Ganon's power. That's what we're doing now, chat. We're collecting the Divine Beasts. The hero with the sealing sword struck the final blow, and the holy power of the princess sealed Ganon so. And that is the story of the brazen attack on Calamity Ganon 10,000 years back. It's obvious Jeff reads to his kids. It sounds like he's had a lot of practice with this kind of thing. <laughs> I, I have spent my fair share sight reading things that rhyme. Thank you for listening. Please come back and hear it again sometime. That was that was my first time reading all of that. I stumbled once or twice, but it went smooth-ish. Smooth 